Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Deus Ex. Today we're going to tackle Battery Park, so let's load it up. I've gotten so used to having to pause every time, it's weird to me that it instantly loads, but not a, a welcome change to be sure. Let's chat with our boat pilot. He's got nothing to say. Okay, let's talk to this kid. I'm starving! Do you have anything to eat? All I have is a candy bar. Don't matter. I just need something in my stomach so I can fall asleep. There you go. Do you have a place to stay? I sleep out on the dock where they unload the speedboats. Speedboats? Is that how the NSF get their supplies? I don't know. They're always coming in and out of the tunnel behind the soda machine. Interesting. I spy on them from the crates. The code is 9183. Clever boy. Thanks for the snack, mister. It's the least I could do. So, secret tunnel behind the soda machine on the dock in Battery Park. Code 9183. Possibly leads to the NSF hideout. That was good. Thanks, Josh. The cleaner nanites make my teeth slippery. I wish everybody was as nice as you. The cleaner nanites make my teeth slippery. So he's done talking. We'll have to pick that open to get inside, but... For the moment, let's dive under the dock. I think there's something down here, if I remember right. Yeah, there it is. Two crates over here. We can get another med kit. And a lockpick. How handy. Now, Battery Park is divided into two sort of main areas, if you will. The Castle Clinton, where we're supposed to go first, and the subway, so I'm kind of going to avoid the subway, do everything else I can do, then tackle Castle Clinton. So if you run up to this statue in the park, you can find a vial of Zyme, which we'll want to hang on to. A vial of Zyme brewed up in some basement lab. Uh, Zyme vials will become useful later, so we'll hang on to that. Let's talk to this guy. Somebody kill me! Anybody? I'm sorry, I can't kill you. Please. Go to a public clinic. They can do something for the pain. It's true. It's your whole body. Every cell. You have the Grey Death? I can't make it. I just can't make it. I bet it's germ warfare. The government's got a cure. They just won't give it to people. I can't feel my fingers. The government's got a cure. They just won't give it to people. Now, a firefight happens in uh, the subway area. And I don't want to trigger it just... Oh, well, I triggered it. As you can see, it gets triggered as soon as you uh, lay eyes on the UNATCO troopers. So, let's avoid that for now. They're gonna start now, I think. Yeah. So I need to make a longer loop to avoid triggering that, because I'd like to try and prevent anyone from dying, if I can. So let's go over here. Let's talk to this guy. No, sir. Forget about the NSF. Most of those old forts have a bolt hole. Those boys will be long gone out of side tunnel by now. You fellas might scare Jim and Jane stay at home, but that's an army out there. I praise the Lord, yes, and honest to God, people's militia. Oh, I seen lots of battles, blessed be our Lord, back in the Northwest War. Didn't have uniforms back then, just a shotgun and all the shells you could carry. The NSF sure has grown up, praise heaven. They got organization now. Now listen to me, young sir. I can tell you, that's what lost it for us last time. What the government's always been good at, and we haven't. But it looks like the boys got some discipline this time round, and your pen better take note. That's right! Stand up, wipe your noses, and take note! You got yourselves a hail! Jesus, you got yourselves a rebellion! Consider the consequences, young sir. Praise heaven! No more hiding below ground. About time we had a battle face to face. 
about time we had a battle face to face. All right. <clears throat> so this is just the other end of the docks. So let's talk to this woman over here. Look at that. Don't have nobody at the side entrance. NSF could just walk away. NYPD. I call them the Flashlight Brigade. All they ever do is come out here and scare the birds. Then I go back to sleep. They're scared. Just look at them. They aren't gonna bite your muscle. They're scared. Just look at them. I don't think there's anything down here. No, there's not. So let's make our way around the castle. There's a crate back here and another man to talk to. Don't let me get in your way, officer. That was a new type of ammo. 7.62 by 51 millimeter ammo. The 7.62 by 51 millimeter NATO round was chiefly used by anti-terrorist units equipped with assault rifles for close quarters combat until its widespread adoption among national security forces requiring enhanced combat responsiveness made it ubiquitous. I'm right here if you need me. You guys are doing great. About time the cops cleaned up this park. Don't let me get in your way, officer. That one was just more 10 millimeter ammo. We make our way around to the front of the castle. We'll find Anna and the other two and a couple more UNATCO troopers. We've got your back, Agent. But if I come out here, they start a firefight too, and I'd like to avoid that as well. So let's... Don't let me get in your way, officer. Let's leave Anna alone for the moment. Let's just, uh... Let's clear out the upper level of the castle first. I can move these crates because I got... Oh, maybe I can't. I thought I could move them with microfibril muscle, but... Maybe I need a, uh... Well, I can push them with microfiber muscle activated. So let's shove the huge ones out of the way. Now from in here, I can hopefully tranquilize most of the guards without triggering a firefight out front. Trigger to fight too. Hmm. <laughs> Let me see what I can do about this. Who was that? I didn't see. what I didn't want. Hmm. Alright, let me think about this. One of my gas grenades might do the trick. Let's try that.
Probably would if I could just throw it a little farther. So... That didn't cut it. I think I need to get closer before I toss it. So, let's try again. Got almost everybody. Uh, trigger Happy Anna Navarra is making this very hard on me. Let's get even closer if I can. Did I get all of them? But the troopers are still murdering them. I don't have enough ammo to do anything with that. What about this? Amazingly enough, that seems like my best shot, doesn't it? Now this is what I signed on for. If I could just get all three of them fast enough, I'd be safe. Who's sad. there? I think the law's on us. Saved two of them. And yes, I consider it saving them, because otherwise Anna and her troopers will just murder them. Come on, come on, come on. I know this is work. So close and yet so far. Was that friendly fire? Might have been. Let's try the front entrance instead. Try just running in and knocking everybody out that way. Or I could just do that. Looks like that is also a negative. It seemed clever to just try closing the door, though. Then I could do everything I'm trying to do in a much more orderly fashion. They found us. That's him. He's a cop. Harder than I expected, but all right, closing the door is not going to work. So, and they get into the fight as soon as I look at them too. I think rushing them from the back is probably the best way to do it. Just need to get one. <laughs> I did not do that time. I'll tell you that. Another try. <clears throat> this is what I signed on for. Alright, another idea. Gas grenade from the front. Hit everybody with it. 
Hopefully it won't turn my people hostile. I got Anna hostile. Firefight from starting for a while at least. Now let's speed things up a little. Take him out. that did it. Let's see. Unconscious. 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 Finally. Well, that was rough. Alright, we'll take that soy food and we'll just eat it to recover five points of health. Let's see, where'd I get shot? The right leg. All right, with that accomplished, I'll definitely quick save. There's some buckshot. Yahoo. Now, before I go into the inner building there, let's cover the whole outside like I wanted to. We've got your back, Agent. Now I can talk to these guys. They won't get far if they try to escape. We've got them pinned down. Be careful. They've got assault guns. We know the Ambrosia's in there somewhere. Never should have transferred. I wonder why the Rebels would back themselves into a corner like this. We've got your back, Agent. All right. I wonder why the Rebels would back themselves into a corner like The Ambrosia is somewhere inside the castle. We must annihilate the NSF so that this does not happen again. I can hold the entrance while you look for another way in. Our orders are to stay here until the Ambrosia is secure. President Meade has declared a war emergency. Shoot to kill. The Ambrosia is somewhere inside the castle. All right, with all that done, I thought there was another crate back here, but I guess I already got it. Now, before I go tackle the castle proper, I like to do the hardest things first, so I'm gonna go ahead and try to take care of the other, uh, the surface battle over in the tenement here, but let's talk to these people first. Our country tis the sweet land of liberty of the I sing. Land where my fathers died, land of the pilgrim's pride, from every mountainside let freedom ring. My native country, the land of the noble free, thy name I love. 
Our country tears of these. And let's talk to this lady now. Got five credits for someone who's got the gray death. Here you go. God bless you. Spare another five credits for someone who's got the gray death. Sorry. Uh, spare another five credits for. I wonder if she ever gives me anything. Here you go. God bless you. I think I'm getting worse. Why can't anybody help me? But spare another five credits. Sorry. All right. Yeah, she'll just keep eating our money. So. Use another well placed gas grenade and hopefully. We can just knock everyone unconscious and prevent any deaths. Hmm. Maybe I need to think of a better approach. I come through here instead. What I need to manage is to get all of the troopers with the gas grenade. I lost a leg just now. Damn it. They've got hostages in the subway station. Didn't work. <clears throat> Came close though. Maybe I need to knock some people out with my baton too. Exactly what I wanted to avoid. Dang it. Getting closer though. If I can just hit all three terrorists fast enough, I should be okay. Damn. That time I missed one of the troopers. It's hard to. Enforce pacifism, I must say. Oops. Well, I definitely can't afford to waste two gas grenades. Well, it's not a waste, but... Oh, come on! Press the button, don't hold it. There you go. rather insistent on killing each other. Let's try again. Again! Oh, man. 
a miss too. Killed one of my troopers, though. Ah! 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 Yeah, this guy. So close, and yet so far. Okay. I think I got all three troopers that time. here and I never saved but gas to clear. And I'd like to make sure that all three of them are just unconscious. If I can. Uh-oh. Well, hell. Let's use another. Maybe we have a chance. This is killing me. I'm not sure how the terrorists know to run after me if they haven't seen me, but it doesn't matter much. Oh. I'm actually running low on tranquilizer ammo, I've noticed as well, but... Terrorist got hit with a gas grenade. One is shooting at me, even though the battle music's not playing. I wish they would just settle down and go back to their posts, but I know they won't. 
Ah! Never killed a cop before. Good grief. How did it not get the third guy? Once more. Careful, these UNATCO guys got Dang. all the tricks. All I need is to verify that the troopers are unconscious and not dead. But it seems like that's gonna be tough. Yeah, I only have two tranquilizer darts left. Closest yet, but still no cigar. Got hostages in the subway station. Damn, they killed him. Just can't quite seem to save everybody. Shoot. 
that was really close. I just needed more time. Folks, I tell ya. Ah! Ah! Come on. Crouch behind your barricades. Don't run in. Stay inside the gas, dudes. Uh-oh. Yeah, I knew that wasn't gonna work. I threw too early. He can't hide for long. Okay, well, this time I'm certain the troops are all unconscious, so... That's him. He's a cop. Somehow they can see me through the walls right there, so... Because I knocked all three troopers out myself. Let me do this, just in case it did work. I'm gonna be pig. Alright. If that worked, I'm gonna keep it. Other use for these med kits, so. Conscious, unconscious. Same save. Make sure no one in here is dead. Okay, good. Maybe we have a chance. I didn't expect him to turn around, but I know I pulled it off, so let me do that and then get my quick save going out here. Now with low tech trained, I should be able to knock them out with the baton if I sneak up behind them. That's him. He's a cop. Okay, Stay here. cool. The guy's still I need to do a better job of that. Maybe I need to hit them in the head. Unlike the charge prod, where it's better to go after the small of the back. Yes. 
that's what you want. up behind him. I hit him without him being aware. Did nothing. Let's try again. There we go. Alrighty. Let's drop that one. And drop the knife. What else we got in the tenement? I know, I think there are at least two more terrorists. But I think they're inside buildings. Check this one. Oh, no one in here. Here's another crate. Another crate. Buckshot in it. We won't go down into the subway until our objectives want us to, but there's a lockpick in here. Very handy. I did get all the terrorists already. That makes things easy. So there are two chests. Here next to the subway entrance, there's a prod charger. You can see some terrorists. Oh, prod. Thought I was far enough away not to get spotted, but. I was not. Oh well. But yeah, this is the one with the lockpick. Then... Grab the charger and I will not cross over to the main entrance just yet. This one has nothing. This one... These two have chests. Okay. Now I honestly don't quite remember what's in each chest. Go ahead and use my lock use a lock pick to find out. This one, well, has a lock pick inside, so that's easy. Net gain of one multi-tool. This one. Med kit and a prod charger. Yeah, the pro not so much the med kit, but the prod charger makes it worth it. Okay, now we're done over here. Let's infiltrate the castle. Check the building inside the main entrance first. We'll ultimately enter through the soda machine, but in here, we 
get a 40 skill point bonus. Kiosk door key added to nano key ring. That opens this door. You're inside the kiosk of Castle Clinton. The bulk of the NSF troops must have gone through here to get underground. So, we've got another boy here who will eat our other candy bar. You a cop? UNATCO agent. How does a little boy get mixed up with the NSF? I just wanted to find some food. But they didn't have any. And then they started shooting at the police. Got some? Want this candy bar? You're cool. Glad I could help. Hey, I bet I can help you. Yeah? The soldiers have secret tunnels. They take boxes into the tunnel under the fort, but they never bring them back out. What kind of boxes? Steel. Big ones. Thanks. Maybe I'll check that out. Thanks, mister. I thought I was going to starve to death. So we get another 50 skill points for talking to The terrorists to didn't even care. They thought I was lying. Thanks, mister. Alright, let's see if this is worth it. I think it is. And we can't blow this one because even if we could find some TNT, we'd kill Billy. The terrorists didn't even care. Ah, yes. They thought I was lying. Commander Grimaldi, I've completed installation of the security measures. Code for the primary lock is 666. I'm heading out to help Commander Fraze's team prepare for the counter-strike. In the meanwhile, my the best advice... The terrorists didn't even care. They thought I was lying. ...is keep your head down. It's going to get real messy real fast. Decker. So... 666 opens that up. I'm only doing this to get the 20 skill point area location bonus. And... Let me... Make sure I'm not lying about that. I'm not. Okay. Now we're going to assault the bunker through the secret entrance. The hardest stuff, you'll be glad to know, is now over. It can be... These battle zones in particular, there aren't very many, but when there are some, they make it highly difficult to get through the game without killing anyone. Or without having anyone die, rather. But so far, so good. So let's pick this open. You can see how once you start using them, you run out of lockpicks fast. The code is 9183. That gives us another 20 skill points. Awesome. So let's loot this room. We can find a multi-tool, a bioelectric cell, Hear some more NSF walking around. If you head down here, I think all you can find is 10 millimeter ammo, but it's there. Completionists should make note of it at least. And why not pick it up? Ammo doesn't take up any inventory space. So if you head down here, you'll notice a couple of things. There's a camera over there we have to be careful of. And there is an NSF guard who I will want to knock out. That's him. He's a cop. I've never been back before. I may want to. Quiet. I got this one. I may want to raise. Look, well, I've got some prod ammo now, so I'll just use that. I was gonna say. I may want to raise low tech to advance before lockpick or anything else. The nice thing is, as you saw, even if I mess up the prod, I can finish the job with the baton instead of using multiple charges. Let's drop that body up there. Let's drop this knife here. 
Our candy bars are gone now, you might have noticed. We gave both of them away. To Josh and Billy. There's another charger here in the corner. Now... Watch that terrorist and see where he goes. Looks like he's not moving. No matter, there are other ways behind him. Let's take the vent then. about that camera as well. Dart out, knock him out, get down the stairs. Leave his body in the vent, along with this knife. Oh, won't let me drop it here. Him taken down. We still need to get the ground level controller here. It's probably easiest to ambush him out of the vent, so let's do that. I think we're still inside of the cameras, so we'll have to be quick. He had a flamethrower! That's definitely a new weapon. Let's check it out. Flamethrower. Weapon stats. Ammo loaded. Napalm canister. Ammo types. Napalm canister. Base damage 2. Clip size 100 rounds. Rate of fire auto. 10.0 rounds per second. Reload time 5.5 seconds. Recoil 0.0. Base accuracy 55%. Accurate range 20 feet. Maximum range 20 feet. Mass 40 pounds. Laser sight NA. Scope NA. Silencer NA. Skill weapons heavy. A portable flamethrower that discards the old and highly dangerous backpack fuel delivery system in favor of pressurized canisters of napalm. Inexperienced agents will find that a flamethrower can be difficult to maneuver, however. Napalm canister. A pressurized canister of jellied gasoline for use with flamethrowers. Inaco Ops file note SC080-Blue. The canister is double-walled to minimize accidental detonation caused by stray bullets during a firefight. Sam Carter. End note. Sweet. Let's drop that out here. Now let's take the vents down to the end just to avoid getting spotted by the camera. At least one more controller, and I think he does come all the way in here. And he turns right around. Hopefully we can get him. He gave us a key, more 10 millimeter ammo, and another knife. And I think he's the last terrorist. So what did we get a key to? The key to Castle Clinton safe. Excellent. So in here, there's 
That, I'm just going to call that assault rifle ammo because it's what it is. In the corner here is a multi-tool. And out here we've got another camera to worry about. We just have to wait until the time is right to get past it. Approach the Ambrosia. Objective complete. Agent Navarre will describe your next assignment and stay behind to protect the Ambrosia. Look for her out front. So finding the Ambrosia gave us 150 skill points, which brings me up to 1295. And my new secondary goal is report to Agent Navarre to receive your orders. What I would like to do is shut off the cameras, which I think I can accomplish inside this computer room. But I'm gonna need a uh, explosive to do it, so turn on microfibril muscle, grab one of these barrels, bring it upstairs. Crouch and leave it by the door. pistol to blow it open. And it didn't work. Alright, well I guess I'll have to use a lockpick then. Which I really didn't want to do. But I can at least open the safe with the key I found. I found some more rockets, I found a med kit, found a napalm canister. In here, there's another augmentation canister and a data cube. Commander Grimaldi, we liberated two canisters of this stuff along with the Ambrosia during the Liberty Island raid, but none of our people are quite sure what it is or what to do with it. Possibly a biological or chemical agent, but without the proper people and equipment, there's no way to tell. Lebedev suggested we keep one of the canisters and the barrel of Ambrosia here as a contingency. The rest was shipped out to the airfield an hour ago. Killian. And, uh, coming into this room gave us 65 skill points, by the way. So I'm up to 1360. We don't know the password here, so we'll just have to hack it. This will let us turn off the cameras, which will be a big help. And... I also don't know the password for this. Let's hack it open. So we can cycle the tunnel doors, and there's no email. That much is good. So with the cameras off, I can properly loot this area. Apparently that crate was empty. Found some more rockets, another med kit, and I don't think there's anything under the water, but I'll check just to be certain. Nope, nothing. Okay. The castle's clear, so we can go talk to Anna now. That was weird. I was certain I could blow open the door up there. Oh well. So let's go talk to Anna. You were too gentle with the NSF, but I cannot complain. You completed the objective. At least you are not a coward like Paul. Say I'm learning as I go and she'll give you two EMP grenades. I'm learning as I go. You just passed lesson one. Lesson two is how we deal with the terrorists in the subway station. I'm ready. 
The terrorists have wired the platform with explosives and put in hostages. Get the hostages out if you can, but make sure the NSF learned that human shields will not work against you, Natco. Nothing we can't handle with a few EMP grenades. We are thinking the same thought. I will equip you with two grenades. They will disable any electronic detonators within a radius of 20 meters. So talking to Anna awards us 10 measly little skill points, <clears throat> but there they are. Our new primary goal is to free the hostages in the Battery Park subway station east of Castle Clinton. I think I'll go ahead and do a real save there. Leave my beginning of the level save. I knew there were more terrorists. Apparently one wandered all the way out here. At least he hasn't gotten into any fights. Take him down, same as the others. More ammo, another knife. This canister can add aqualung or environmental resistance, but we need to find the med bot before we can install it. I'll take environmental resistance. Because we run into poison gas more often than we run into long swims. Pretty basic rationale, but... If you want to get in here, I prefer this vent for entering the subway. I don't think this middle one helps much. I think we have to go all the way down, but let me check just to be sure, like usual. Well, now I'm lost. I think I'm above them right now. The NSF terrorists in the subway have threatened to blow up the platform. Watch for booby traps. Yeah, I'm above them. I need to go down another level. What I want to do is... It's, act it's entirely possible to talk to both hostages without getting noticed. I swear I heard something. Bash it. Uh-oh. Okay. Let's not get lost this time. Let's do a little bit better job choosing our way in. Let's go through this panel. Down this ladder, all the way to the bottom, without jumping off this time, ideally. Alright, now we're on the bottom level. Just need to make my way around to the back of the platform. That's where I fell and got nailed last time. All the way around to the back. Hostages are right here. Sir, who are you? I'm a UNATCO agent. As soon as I open the train doors, I need you both to be ready to run on board. Okay. <laughs> well, that didn't work. Sir, who are you? I'm a UNATCO agent. As soon as I open the train doors, I need you both to be ready to run on board. Okay. 
Now let's just open the doors. Saving the hostages gave me 300 skill points, so I'm up to 1670. My new primary goal is to report to Paul in Hell's Kitchen, but first, I want to—I'd still like to handle the terrorists. There's another charger by this column. Very nice. If you screw up and the hostages get killed, you only get 100 skill points. Some of these guys are stationary and some are moving. I want to just take them down one at a time if I can. Who's there? I think the law's on us. Take him out. It's like I've got eight terrorists total. Take him out. Oops. Here even they hear one takedown and then they blow the TNT. Well, maybe it depends on which one I take down. Let's try a different tactic. I'd like to get the first patroller if I could. When are we gonna see some action? I guess this beats starving back home. Can't hide for long. I'm gonna get this pig. There are five on the platform. I think we're safe. The guy vanished. I think he took off. Who was that? I didn't see a uniform. Nothing. I guess we're safe. Okay. Well, I got I dropped one and the platform didn't blow, so let's 
see about the others. They've all settled, which is good. I'm running low on energy, so I'm trying to avoid using my light if I can help it. Get this guy next. Good. That time, nobody alerted. Let's drop him. Reload my prod. Three to go. This guy had a flamethrower. Let's hide him back here, too. Still got another one and they didn't blow the platform. That's good. That's what we're after. Let's get this guy next. He's got a sawed off shotgun. And the other guy's a sitting duck. I don't really need to hide the bodies anymore. We're just about done in here. He gave me some buckshot. Let's drop the last one. He gave me even more 10 millimeter ammo, so now I can drop everything I don't need. We've seen all those weapons already. Another lock pick, always handy. Anything else on the platform? I don't think there's any way to shut down the lasers. And it gave me an EMP grenade, but I really don't want to use it, so... Now that everyone's safe, I think I'm going to blow the platform on purpose. Because I'm, if I remember right, that will destroy the lasers. So... Let's drop everybody back here, safe inside the vents. killed anybody. Got one, two, three, four, five unconscious terrorists. Th 
three guys up there are okay, and... I think the hostages disappeared, so... Everybody's fine. Let's go get these last three terrorists. Although I am quite certain that they'll hear me using the prod, so let's get this. I know I heard something. Good news, of course, is. Can hit them once with the prod and then do the rest of the job with the baton. 10 millimeter ammo and knife, 10 millimeter ammo, 10 millimeter ammo. Drop the knife. Get the goodies. Lock pick. More 10 millimeter ammo. Now, of course, we're free to use the main entrance. Let's talk to everybody one more time before we leave. I don't have it in me to stress out about killing rats. Spare another five credits. Sorry. Need to hold on to my credits. Our country tears of the sweet land of... There's no one inside the castle anymore, good work. which is good. We'll take it from here. We'll finish mopping up. You better get to Hell's Kitchen. The fighting's pretty rough up there. I'd like to know where the rest of the shipment went. I'd like to know where the rest of the shipment went. You better get to Hell's Kitchen. The fighting. Excellent work. I hear that every terrorist in the subway is flat on his back. You are showing some promise. Take the subway and report to your brother in Hell's Kitchen. Your brother Paul has gotten our troops into another mess. Paul has his unit scattered and pinned down by heavy resistance in Hell's Kitchen. The NSF regrouped in Hell's Kitchen, perhaps because it is close to where they had taken the Ambrosia. You have your orders. I will manage the situation in Battery Park. You are showing some promise. I think because I blew the platform, some people think I killed the terrorist, but I am secure in the knowledge that I did not. Thanks, mister. Let me get in your way, officer. Oh, it's horrible. Oh, Lord have mercy, why? Those were good boys. Every last one of them. That's what I mean when I say the goal is extermination. They don't need people. They just want to have machines do it all and get rid of everybody they don't need. Mother of God! Oh, it's horrible. Oh, guess the cops got what they wanted. <laughs> no thanks to the NYPD bunch of do nothings. I think the United Nations should just step in and take over security for the whole country. It'd be much less corrupt that way. I guess the cops got what they wanted. <laughs> I think that just leaves Josh and the sick man. I doubt. That was good. I doubt they say anything different. Where is the sick man? There he is. I bet it's germ warfare. Alright, that's it for Battery Park.
Managed to keep everyone alive. So let's take the train now and head to Hell's Kitchen. I will call that a section. Oh good, the hostages are alive. I have to admit I was a little bit worried. So, we'll do a save at the beginning of this section, make a new quick save. That's it, that was Battery Park. I'll see you next time on Let's Play Deus Ex. Bye-bye.